Hey guys, this is J Mart here. I got a fun video that I'm doing today and I love lights, especially around Christmas time because you can go all crazy with all the lights and stuff like that. Um, I love lanterns, I like candles, I like LED string lights and all that type of stuff. Um, one of the things that I've done though with a lot of my decorating um, for Christmas, even Halloween, um, I go through a lot of batteries. Um, so I came across a really cool product because there's sometimes, you know, the batteries are nice, but there's sometimes you're close to a power source and you want to take advantage of that and not have to burn through batteries. So I'm going to go ahead and show you some fun stuff that I, I, I can do with um, some alternatives, what usually uses batteries. All right, we're going to come over here. And over here, we have already do have some candles over here. Um, you know, with some little LED lights and all these are battery operated. Um, I've got some lanterns over here that are actually solar ones. Um, they, you know, the solar stuff starts going out after a few years and stuff like that. You got to replace batteries. Sometimes the components get damaged and they just don't work as well. Um, but what's really cool about this is that I'm finding some ways to repurpose some of these items here. So let's go ahead and take a look. Um, so the, the cool um, item that I found is basically, it's a AC adapter. Oh, Paul, sorry about that guys. Just trying to get the, uh, the, the angle set up here properly. But what I came across is on Amazon, this product that takes batteries and you can put a regular uh, plug in wall wart type adapter. So here's some batteries that are used to kind of complete the circuit because some items might use two or three batteries and stuff like that. And then this is what we'll end up using. And you can see we this particular one actually has 10 different uh items that you can connect to it right and it's just like christmas lights and i'll i'll show you the the wall adapter right here so you can see that and actually it's very similar to like the christmas lights and different things like that you would do um it has even the screw on adapter where you can connect um a different power source and stuff like that a lot of the christmas lights and things like that i've noticed actually are starting to use these so all right, so let's go ahead and put that together and we're going to plug this into the wall and see how this works for the different devices. Okay. All right, so I already got this one already hooked up. So this right here takes two batteries. Like I said, I put one, they're called blanks that just completes the circuit. So I put a yellow battery in here and then this is one that goes right in here. So this is some of those little string lights that you can wrap around different things. And there you go, look at that, we got power to it. Um, let's do another one of these, uh, these little candles right here and pop that in. Oh, look at that, isn't that awesome? Now I don't have to go through so many batteries. I go to Costco all the time and I buy these packs and you know, I go through so many of them all the time. I honestly, I love how I'm going to be able to use this as a trick to be able to do it. Here's one of my cool outdoor lanterns that has a little flame in it. And this one only requires one battery. See, look at that. So you notice it turned off because it is a solar one and it has the ambiance sensor in it. So I would ne probably need to get some electric tape or something like that, cover that up so that it will trigger the light on. And there, there it goes. But this particular one, you can put up to 10 different um, candles, string lights, lanterns, or whatever to it. And then, like I said, you just use these, these blanks if that needs um, multiple um, batteries um, to complete the circuit. Uh, for instance, you know, if I don't have this extra one in there, See, it's just, uh, well, that's the main one, but let's take this one out and then put this one back in there. It needs that to complete the circuit. 
So once I put the blank back in and we're good to go. Pretty cool, right guys? So yeah, check that out. I'll put a link in the description if you're interested in buying this. I'll do some other videos. They got this one that does 10. I bought some that can do three. Um, they got somewhere that just does one. I got a cool, fun little project that I wanna do for a little lamp post um, that I'll be doing one of those for. Uh, so check out my other videos as I find fun ways to um, kind of retweak different things with this. So, all right, guys, make sure to subscribe if you haven't and leave a like and comments or any of that fun stuff. Um, if this is content that you appreciate, I have a lot of fun with it. So I hope you guys do too. See ya.